it was it was such a long shot. We we tried several hundred thousand incorrect ways of solving the cipher, and just by chance we happened to sort of stumble upon a fragment of, of how it could be solved. And using that fragment, we reverse engineered the, the entire solution and uh, got the, the entire message out from the Zodiac. So, I mean, I'm not, I'm not an expert on, on what the Zodiac had to say. I, I managed to help to, to get that message out. Um, it doesn't reveal his identity. It doesn't give a lot of clues to his identity. I think more what it does is the the method that he was able to use to create that uh, that cipher um, may help uh, track down who he is. David Aranchak is from the United States, and he has been working on trying to solve this cipher in his spare time for 15 years, uh, which is a Herculean effort. Uh, I, I saw some of the videos that he'd put online promoting analysis that he'd done of this cipher, and I thought they were excellent. And so I, I reached out to him in, I think, about March of this year, and it was sort of a way of getting through the, the Melbourne COVID lockdown uh, was to, to play around with this in my spare time. Uh, it was a homophonic substitution cipher, so uh, letters in the, uh, the text that the Zodiac was encrypting is replaced with multiple symbols. But then the, the reading direction that we're normally used to is, you know, left to right, top to bottom on a, on a page. Uh, whereas what the Zodiac did in this, in this cipher was to, to write it out down the diagonals of the, of the page. So he went uh, one, one row down, two columns across, one row down, two columns across in order to write it out. And trying to stumble across that correct enumeration was, uh, was one of the main difficulties here. The chances of solving this after 50 years was next to next to zero, and so being able to play a role in this is fantastic. Um, you know, I hope this decryption may lead to uh, you know better narrowing down who this person is. Um, but I guess we'll have to wait and see. In regards to the other two ciphers that he sent, where we're looking at those to see if there's ways in which we can we can uh, use the work that we've done on the 340 cipher to, to solve those. Um, but none of that is clear at this stage.